Welcome to step two, heart coherence. We're going to tune your ticker with this one of the hamburger method. So why is it fabulous? Your heart and your brain, you actually have brain cells in your heart um, and also in your gut as well. And they can get out of sync. Um, a bit like a bad karaoke duo. We've all heard them. I'm probably one of them. So this technique gets the 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 brain cells and the um, and the brain, the heart, and the gut all harmonising like they're auditioning for your country's got talent. So when do you do this? After you've done step one. So if you haven't done step one, go back and do that now. Um, how to nail it? Fo I want you to focus on your heart. Just imagine your heart like it's the star of the show. Notice every beat, how it contracts, opens and contracts, and it's that there's a beautiful rhythm to it. Now, do something weird with me. Breathe in through your heart and out through your heart. It sounds weird, but you're not going to be able to do this wrong. Whatever way you do it, it's perfect. And just allow yourself that moment to breathe in and breathe out through your heart. And imagine your brain connecting to your heart. Now, extra points. When you're thinking about, when you're breathing in and imagining your heart, your breath breathing in through your heart and breathing out, Think of something that makes you feel warm and fuzzy inside. Now I say that and that sounds wooey, wooey. However, um, it's about bringing that gratitude and appreciation into it as well. So I like to think about my dogs, the people I love in my life. It just takes that to the next level of, oh, I'm like literally so grateful for them. And the bonus, bonus point is, and you'll see me do this often in videos or even when I'm talking to people as well, I will literally give you a hug for your brain because when I put my hand on my heart, I have trained myself to do this and just drop down into my heart and take those breaths. So even in the middle of conversations, I'll have a moment where I'm like, I'm having that gratitude moment and I'm like, oh, that's really sweet. And it changes. It's like the person I'm talking to gets a hug for their brain. So I encourage you to try this technique and see me in the next video and I'll walk you through it.